Well, hey guys, and welcome back, Drill Freak Nation. We got a cool episode this time, and what we're going to look at is our grip. Now, this is a different grip than I'm going to uh, propose to some of you guys and gals out there. So, if, if you've taken a short game lesson uh, from me, you'll know that I like to see an overlap, reverse overlap grip for, for uh, the reason of being able to spin the ball a little bit more. And I've had a lot of clients that come back and said, wow, this is amazing how I can spin this ball, hit this nice low spinner coming in, you know, uh, 50, 40 yards, 30 yards, 20 yards, anything inside those areas, you can really spin this ball. Uh, you know, you're going to get one of those balls that just lands, checks you get about three foot of roll so basically this episode is going to be called the anti-flip grip now again remember i just mentioned how we we use it for short game for spinning but what we found out in the past is a lot of clients who happen to be people who flip with their hands and especially the lead you know the lead hand and they're, they're, they get a little flippy well with this particular grip and i'm going to show you i'm going to get up close here so me being a right-handed player my normal grip right there is a Hogan grip. I have an overlap right there. Some people refer to it as Varden, but this is a little bit more Hogan because of where the, the placement is of the uh, pinky of my right hand. However, that being said, for this particular episode, we're gonna talk about the reverse overlap or the anti-flip grip, and you're gonna see where my left hand, this trigger finger, right now is placed over the pinky of my right hand, being a right-handed player. And I'm going to put pressure, continually putting pressure against that knuckle right there. And if you notice when I do that, look at how my lead wrist is really bowed coming through. Well, that's, that's really cool in a golf swing because that's going to give us leverage. We're going to get some really good chaff lean, catch the ball uh, really nice, a uh, little bit low on the sweet spot and let it roll back up. And that's where we're going to get that spin. So basically, again, uh, what you're going to do is you're going to grab the club, right hand, Take the left hand and just take that trigger finger of the left hand over and we're going to put pressure. And you can see when you do that, you're going to get some supination of the lead hand, pronation of the right. And that is what we are looking for. And just not just spinning the golf ball, but really cool, solid contact, straight, powerful, effortless shots. So again, the anti-flip grip try it out it's it's a it's a great way especially try it out first with the short game and i i know again i've had clients in the past who have said i like this grip so much i hit it so well i've continued to stay with the grip and that's again that's your call but again the anti-flip grip is a reverse overlap it's a reverse overlap give it a give it a try try it out okay hope you guys enjoyed this last episode we got a lot more coming up this season